Good morning from Alton Towers. It's a very special type of day at Alton Towers for us today. It's Secret Weapon Saturday. It's our first enthusiast event of the season, isn't it, Mike? Yeah. So the uh, the running order of the day is one hour's ERT, which is exclusive ride time on Wickerman. Essentially, we've got the Wickerman booked between nine o'clock and ten o'clock this morning, where only anyone with one of these and a lanyard can access. If you are interested in doing something like this with us in the future, please have a look in the description of this video where there is more information about it. But yeah, starting the day with an hour on the Wicker Man. Can't wait, it's gonna be great to get on it. We have asked for permission to do a POV. It's currently 50-50, that'll be allowed. Hopefully, we'll be able to, but for now, we're going on the Wicker Man, so we'll see you after we've done it. Excited, yeah. yeah. Let's back. get burned alive. Exactly, feed the flames. Second best one in the country. Yeah, behind best the national. Theme, best themed one no, in the best Oh, I agree with that, definitely. I didn't grab nationals, like, throw yourself downstairs. <laughs> Behave. <laughs> Everybody excited? Yeah. yeah. Excited, yeah. Cool. Excited. Well, hey. Excited, guys. That's what we like. Thumbs up. Excited, Doug? Yeah. Spot on. There we go. You got, you got to lock it in for us. There you go, Alton Towers. You've got a new ride up. So we've done the ERT on Wicker Man, and I'm going to start getting some opinions. Mark, Mr. Superfan, what are you doing at Alton Towers, firstly? Don't tell Pleasure Beach I'm at Alton Towers, that's a secret. <laughs> no, they're not allowed to know. Did you enjoy your first ERT experience with us? It was really good, Scott. I've only been on Wicker Man once before, and that was a couple of years ago, but having six or seven rides on it without a queue was absolutely brilliant. And it's great, isn't it? And then uh, Oblivion later. Yeah, yeah, thing. Definitely, yeah, definitely. Good stuff. Well, hope you have a good rest of your day. Thank you very much, you And uh, hope you get soaked on the rapids. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> we've got um, we've now got Paul with us, a regular of uh, Crane Crazy, I believe. <laughs> Andy was stealing him off you for a minute. What did you think? Brilliant! I really, really yeah. enjoyed it. First ERT I've ever done. Eight laps, wicker man. First thing you've already flying around. And, it. and not a queue in sight. Not a queue in sight. Straight up, brilliant. What do we say to Andy for not booking yeah, on? You should have. No, you should have come there. You so missed it. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least he's coming to Leesburg. But yeah, good to see you, Paul. Yeah, Thanks bit, for mate. being here, Loved mate. It. Really good. Excellent. Excellent.
It's the Blues Brothers, just been on Wickham and we've lost our hats unfortunately. <laughs> they were not on a mission from God, just on a mission from yeah. YouTube I think. Yeah. Everybody yeah. needs somebody to love. Absolutely. <laughs> Gonna have to watch that later now. <laughs> so Wickham and ERT, what did you think? Fantastic, oh, they're the trains are flying out there. Three train service from them guys on there is brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, so it is. Fast. And that's before a moist rail. Yes, we'll have, do, we'll have to do it later on with a moist rail as well. We've got a few spots of rain, but think of the dump of the streets, is it? It's, it's going to be a good day, man. Good nah, day. always do good events. Yes. But rain or shine, yes. doesn't matter. Always good events, so yeah. We're back. We're not back fit yet, but we'll get there, you know. Got a few friendlies, but no VAR today. No, we'll no VAR, no good. We don't want any of that. <laughs> but yeah, also, while I remember, thank you to the uh, tech services guys that let me take the camera on eventually. Uh, hopefully the POVs have come out all right. But yeah, good start to the day, Craig. Fab start. Excellent. Looking forward to the rest of the day. And the McCurse yet, looking forward to that. Have you ever done it? Nope. Oh, excellent. Nope. So looking forward to that. Well, um, so we can get your reviews on that in a bit then? Definitely. Yeah, yeah. spot on. Right, well, I'm going to take these off, Craig, because uh, actually, it's easier to see with these on. <laughs> it's quite bright now, that sunshine. 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 Yes. Right, so, I don't know what we're doing next, but we'll see where the day goes. Want to ride mine, try maybe some more? Hashtag choo choo. Choo choo, oh yeah. No sunglasses, unfortunately. Craig's taking them back, but uh, we have had a free train ERT on Wicker Man. What do you think? Good. Absolutely yeah. brilliant. The uh, hats off to the, to the staff in there. Credit to them, honestly. Chucking them trains out. Atmosphere is always good. They get involved as well. Yeah, absolutely brilliant. ERT. The they were no stacking, was there? No, no. Literally, as soon as the train was ready, it was going. So it's all you, it's all you can want. And literally, like you appreciate that everyone just gets on, gets on the train, get out and enjoy it. Absolutely. So. Uh, for reference, there's around 150 people here today, and uh, if you are interested in doing an event like this, we will be doing more of these, probably another one at Towers in September, we're thinking, aren't we? Yep. Not sure on the rides yet, but keep an eye on our socials for that. But in the meantime, we're gonna go do some more rides now. We will be covering the uh, the Curse at Alton Manor and the Runaway Mine Train, and uh, not the Nemesis, though. The Rita. The Rita and the 13. But well, yeah, we'll see where the day takes us from here. So, Craig, Curse at Alton Manor, your first go. What are you expecting? I'm not quite sure, because really, people say it's been working great, not working great, there's things missing, things like that. I think you need a few goes to uh, find out the real. Well, I've heard so much good stuff about it. We're really looking forward to it. Good stuff. It's a bit different. And we did the mine train. It was a good fun, wasn't it? It was hashtag choo choo. All aboard. What are you expecting from this? I don't really know. Well, that's I've, helpful. I've, uh, I've deliberately not followed any, I've not looked at anything on socials, so that it's a bit of a surprise to me. Fair enough. Right, well, we'll go on it and get Mike and Craig's review shortly. <laughs> How are you? Not bad, how are you? A bit of a headache, but I'm alright. <laughs> you know how it is. I think a bit of aspirin won't cure. Yeah, so have you been inside the house? I have, yeah. It's good. I know you're interested in buying, you know, the problem. I don't, don't think I can afford to this time. Ah, that is fine. There's uh, some potential clients on the way through the queue, though. Ah, excellent. Well, if they're not convinced now, I'm sure if they have a look around, they might have their heads turned. Uh, absolutely, time, yeah. yeah. So it's time for a takeover of the Curse at Alton Manor. Full group takeover, not an ERT or anything, just group takeover. Ride staff are not going to be happy with us, I don't think. <laughs> Seal of approval. Hello. Here he is. Best star ride in the country. <laughs> Where have we seen with my hands open? <laughs> We've been to the auction. The uh, Alton Manor is for sale. Mike, did you make a purchase and what did you think of the new ride? I'm well impressed. Yeah. I've just, I think as an enthusiast, I love all the little references yeah. to all, all the old rides about. Um, I like the fact that you've, they've managed to keep the same ride yes. and make it different. Yeah, I agree. Time. There's loads of little 
familiar bits in it. Yeah. Like a lot of the moving stuff yeah. is the same figures just dressed up. Yeah. But then there's all these sort of really modern effects. Yeah, there is. Sort of, I think lenticular might be the wrong word for it because I suspect it's more technical than that. But it's, uh, it's a lot more than just screens, which people were worried about, that it yeah. would just be an overhaul of screens everywhere. But there is a lot more to it than just yeah. screens. I think the technology that has been used in it yeah. is really Advanced, it's really, I mean, it might be advanced, but it's really clever. It's what they needed. Yeah. Oh, oh. please remain seated. Please stop. Better sit down, mate. Craig's also been to the auction of Alton Manor. Did you make a purchase? Did you make a bid? No, I never made a bid, uh, but uh, um, it's a bit out more price range, really. Yeah, it's a bit, <laughs> bit too scary for me to own that place, I think. <laughs> yes. And that's not just a price tag. Well, what do you think of the ride being serious? I think. Um, probably need more than one rider to yes. take it all in. There's a couple of dark spots, but I don't know if anybody else can take in the attic vibe you know, from the... Um, the old maze that was here? Yeah, the maze that was in the... Scarefest, is that? Scarefest, yeah. attic, from the, in the towers. I've not you done Scarefest since 2020. Yeah. Okay, that sort of vibe, <laughs> I thought it was really good. Some of the effects are brilliant. Yeah. I think some of them are not probably working, I don't know. So you need... But I'm really impressed. I prefer loads more to Jewel. So I prefer the original haunted house. I agree. So, um, I mean, John's done a fantastic job with all the effects in there. John and John. Yeah, oh yes, the two Johns. The yeah. two Johns have done a cracky job, but yeah. It is a, it is a brilliant ride, and you need more than one guy. I agree. To take more in. And I've only just had two, so. And the uh, the Roman actors are about, so we'll go and get a grave dug for Mike soon, I think. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I think so as well. <laughs> they actually, uh, when I came here to do some filming with Becker on Wednesday, they actually employed me as a grave digger, so I'm late for work today, so I'll have to go and get started You're going to dig your own hole then, mate. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> Especially wearing those bloody sunglasses. <laughs> right, on to the next ride then. So the Nemesis construction walls have been moved back a little bit, so we can now have a bit more of a nosy, which Craig is doing. What are you thinking, Craig? Re-theme? Yeah, it's got to be a re-theme, I think, yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't know what to, though. No. Uh, but in I hope it doesn't... In the yeah. <laughs> I hope it doesn't lose some of its original essence, though, you know what I mean? The, the good old stuff. But, uh, yeah, I, don't I know think they should call it The Nemesis. Just the nemesis. because everybody calls it The, the nemesis, nemesis anyway. The Nemesis. So the the nemesis. Nemesis. Yeah, The Nemesis. But you see look, the, the lift deal still there, like which they're going to leave in any case, and the brake will, aren't they? So, yeah. But um, it's much intriguing is if the camera can look at his behind me. Yes, we'll uh, we'll do an overlay, so we'll talk yeah, about I'll, it first and film it yeah, second. Look at, look at the viewing platform come Q4. Subterra. Subterra, so Subterra's definitely open. Are we allowed open. to talk about that? Yeah, or is yeah. That, it's, is that it's, still banned? It's going gonna, it's gonna to open, isn't it? So, because the queue's in part of taking with that. So, plus, it will be a good uh, viewing platform up there as well. And yeah. that's really good of towers to do that because you never get to see the transition of a ride. And have a look at, over the old place itself. The thing is, really I'm good. not picking on any other parks, but a lot of parks would just be like, no, you're not watching, end of. Yeah, Whereas but, towers yeah. are like, yeah, come and have a look, see what we're doing. Whereas a lot of parks would have just been like, no, you're not seeing it. Yeah. You'll see it when we want you to see it. Whereas towers are like, yeah, come and have a look. And I've been really open about it, so that's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, the track, new track probably should be on site, I'd have thought, very soon. <laughs> That's early. I thought it'd be an overwinter job, but... I think it'd be, think it'd be here soon. Cool. We'll I think keep, so. Keep an eye out for that, definitely. Yeah. But um, I was thinking as well, like, they've just opened all this path up as well, I just thought I'd mention that, because this, this is the first time I think... Has this been open the first time? It wasn't time? like this on Wednesday, when we were here. Oh, I think it's probably for the accessibility-wise as well, yeah. for wheelchairs. I mean, you can't really get down the other side. With no. So, it's good. a good thing as well. So, it's good. I mean, at least they're keeping this fantastic ride. You know what I mean, it'll be good for another 30 years. Hopefully it'll be not too much different. Might even be better, you never know. Well, at least you've kept the lift still, mate. The rest of it's been replaced. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's going to be good, it'll be good. Uh, yeah, this is weird down here, because I've never been down here without Nemesis. So it's, uh, yeah, it's really odd. <laughs> it's just, don't quite know what to make of it at the moment. It just doesn't look right. No. Really, it's like, there's supposed to be a, like a zero G roll and a, loop there bizarre would you like them to re-theme it michael no no i wouldn't mind sort of doing it up a bit yeah well they are doing it mate. it's gone they're getting a new one the only thing that's a theme you clown <laughs> <laughs> yeah but as 
Subterra looks like it's coming back. It is coming back, yeah. But, I, know, I know that like we're not allowed to talk about that, but yeah, it's coming back. It's pretty. Oh, obvious. this is just an observation of walking past. Yes, no one's like hiding on the queue lines there. <laughs> yeah, um, they've got you know speakers, testing the audio, screens, phalanx, read on the queue line, and stuff like that. Yeah. So uh, yeah, I think if, that's coming back. If Subterra is coming back, then you've got to keep the. Uh, Sorry, I'm just turning the tracking off. Carry you've on. got to keep the Nemesis theme. The Nemesis. Because otherwise, the. Subterra doesn't make sense without Nemesis. No, it doesn't. So, unless they retheme Subterra. Well, whatever whatever they're doing with Subterra, will link into the new theme yeah. or the refurbed theme of Nemesis. I think that's my opinion. It's anyway. Got you on it. Yeah, definitely. Right, we're gonna go and do Galactica because that's uh, one of Craig's many wishes of the day. So, you gotta keep the Craig toy happy. And, <laughs> you know, it's part selfie of selfie king selfie king and he brings everybody lollies <laughs> so uh, Galactica it is Aye. Galactica then Mark? Yeah, three weeks later. <laughs> 84 years. Yeah. How was it? Um, well, well, obviously the last fly I did was fly. Yeah. It's only when you come back onto this, you realise how how technology's moved on. Yeah. And they're hanging down all the way up and then they're hanging at the end. It's like, no thanks. No for me. And, uh, we were the watching gallery, weren't we? Yeah. We, we were having our packed lunch, but <laughs> we're rooted with it. Mr. Positive. What a ride that was. I suck soaring through the sky. Super to ride that ride. Yeah. So, so good. Coming in, Mark. <laughs> I saw it to the trees. It's been so smooth. <laughs> I mean, it's smooth. I think it was nearly asleep on it, but like. <laughs> it's just a bit different. I know, I mean, it's not over his cup of tea, but. No, and it's nothing like. Is it Manta, Manta Sea Rolling? Yeah, it is, yeah. I mean, that, that's unreal, that one. It's a bit of pretzel loop there. Any ride I've ever nearly blacked out, I think. But... So, what you're saying is you don't want an ERT on it in September? No. Absolutely not. <laughs> I, think, I think it'd be right, you know. It'd be right. You get about to get two rides in it, and then, like, that's how long it takes to, uh, to to load everybody in, like, you know what I mean? It's just to get an angry exercise, you know, yeah. Not for me, thank you. Yes, for me, please. <laughs> <laughs> what does Mike think? Why ERTs do we need next year? Well, do I do my train? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 This is why he's not in vlogs anymore. All right, next time he's not in a vlog and you say, where's Mike? Just remember, he's a clown. And that, that's sorted, all right? Spoiler. Oh, oh God. God. Why? Come here. Yeah. It's give me, my give... shopping trolley. Yeah, give me one good reason why we need to go on that today. I've heard it's closed. It's, um... <laughs> it's, um... it's a world record holder. The only one in this country? Yeah, the most now. aggressive shopping trolley in the world. <laughs> takes the corners better than a shopping trolley. Oh, so I don't know, mate. Just... Mate, he doesn't take the corners better than an aerodynamics coaster <laughs> built in the 70s. What do you think even demons smoother? Come on, positive, positive. That's a positive. All right. Here he is. Record holder, the only one in the country. The most fences, the most fences in any queue line. <laughs> it's been on waste hands penitentiary, actually, what you <laughs> To be fair, look how much he loves it. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> what, the net's in? Hey, you know, girl. Responsible for us going on the smiler. Um, I've got a lot of time for Craig. Well, I did, but not so sure after that. If you can hear the music in the background, it's not the church. Right. This is my church. It's well, that Greg. was Villa Park. <laughs> well, that's one as well. <laughs> How many churches do you need? Let me just say this is the world record, all them going down country. It's not appreciated enough. 
What a fair play to Scott and the boys. They got an interest for me. I really enjoy it. I'm there from my wife. It was nice. You know what? It was better than the back row the other week. I'll give them that. It's better than the second row. However, I think the trip to the dentist the other week was more enjoyable, and that is quite rare. So it is getting a bit bumpy. Uh, we get him. It. it always has been. Although I'll give it some credit, it's not as bad as saw. That's true. And let's well, Mark's uh, getting his sandwiches in a minute, but we'll ask him in a minute. Oh, here he is. <laughs> so we go and get him now. Bring him in. Oh, yeah. Just bring him in. He'll moan. Honestly, never again. No. <laughs> It's dreadful. It's absolutely awful. It's like... Oh, worst can't describe how bad that thing is. It gets worse every year. You know, like, you never see Inferno gets better. It ages like a fine wine. Yeah. That's, that's like more like sour milk, I'm telling you. <laughs> Honestly, it's that bad. I think I'd rather go on the retro squad. Talking of that, I think Greg's going to make us do that now. So, uh, Red to Fries. Red to Fries, also known as... Twister Ron or Twister Fon with his fake Transformer theme in, so we won't do that, I think. What did you think about Rent-A-Prize? rent or, or Twister Fon, yeah, rent is a brilliant name. No, I really enjoyed it. You know, everybody, everybody say they don't like it at all, I don't know why. I think a lot of people just don't do spinning rides. Exactly. Plus, as well, you get to sit down and look at that fabulous roller coaster over there. The Smiler? Uh, fabulous. Fabulous is the last word. I'm sorry, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> now, to be fair, that was a lot better than I thought it ever would be. I really enjoyed it. Honestly, really good. Good. So we've got the um, the Rapids takeover coming up. But firstly, Mike wants to talk about food because he's our pizza correspondent today. <laughs> so would you like to talk about the uh, pizza and pasta place? Yes, yeah, so there's been a lot made in the last week or so, a couple of weeks, about the prison food. <laughs> prison food, if you want to put it that Let's way. Let's just yeah. cut to the chase. Prison yeah, food. Yeah, like the catering here at Alton Towers. Results. Not much of it positive, I've got to say. I've not heard anything hardly about... I've heard a lot of complaints about price, about quality, about service. To be honest, that weren't bad today. Look. Price, yeah, I agree. I don't really think I would... I don't really... Even with my past this guy, 14, 60-odd, I don't really think I'm getting value out of that in the same way I was when it was 10 or 11 or 12 pounds. In terms of service, fine, no problem. Virtually walked in and we were seated within two or three minutes. Not a problem. Excellent. And quality, yeah, it was all right. It, it wasn't the worst I've ever had, but it wasn't the best pizza I've ever had either. But, um, Really, I thought, I don't think it was, the quality was bad. I can see, I think I was quite lucky in that. I'm going to stop you there. I don't think it was that bad. I think I was quite lucky in that the, um, the pizzas were quite fresh, really, or I was able to get some fresh pizzas. I can see why people would be disappointed if they'd been sat there a while. Um, I will say that. But um, I didn't think it was too bad. Um, I probably will, will obviously have their opinion on this front. But uh, yeah, on to the rapids. Yes, I'm going to just join on this conversation and say that Woodcutters was not the best the other week. That's why I'm not eating on park today, but Becca and Charlie went to Woodcutters before and had no complaints, so maybe they're getting better. We'll just have to see how it goes over the next couple of weeks. But Could be a new se could be an early season thing, could be a training thing, yeah. you know. Anyway, Rapids, obviously we can't take the camera on, but Big Boat, do you want to oh, go and assemble yeah. your boat?
construction may result in your ejection from the resort. Having fun? Yeah, excellent. come to the end of our day at Alton Towers which has been extended by quite a long time in the end hasn't it? It has, it has. But fair play to them obviously like you know staying that and honouring the, the hour and you know what they're very chipper. Yeah absolutely so the plan was to have Oblivion for an hour from half six to half seven. Oblivion got a technical problem at five o'clock. We eventually started DERT at quarter to seven Yeah. and it's eight o'clock now and we're at Tower Street so I'm going to keep this short but it has to be said a massive thank you to tech services, to the ride operators and everyone else that stayed behind to make this ART possible. Yeah. But overall, good great, day. Great day, great day. Great ART at the end as well. I believe it was just so many laps on it, so incredible. Alton Towers know how to do events. Yeah. They're, they're organised from start to finish, from the first contact to the last part of the day. They know what they're doing and they do a great job, great value. So from all of us, thank you. And uh, we will be back for another event, but I think we're a bit too tired to carry on with anything else for now. Yeah. So many thanks for watching. Please give us a thumbs up. It really helps the channel and we'll see you next time.